All right, I'm done. Okay. I'll be back in here later. I'm having my ice cream thaw. Well, I'm going to. Don't forget about that ice cream. I won't. I never do. Do you like that one? No. Not that one. Put the other one. Really happening fast, isn't like, it? Don't worry, somebody has to be. your freaking first time. I don't understand. You meant it's really the first time. In your field. You should try that. Yes, my very first time was my first well, now, time. Isn't there uh, some kind of experimental glove or some machine or something? You do understand that it is money is no object. It's not a question of money, Mrs. Collins. Unfortunately, we cannot duplicate the conditions of the but this is crazy. I mean, there's got to be something that you can do. I wish there was, Mrs. Collins. Can we see the baby? Of course we can. But don't be shocked when you see her. She doesn't look like a full term baby looks. Her skin is a little translucent. She's very tiny. Oh, they're so cute. I love them. Huh? Premature babies, this is small. So 
daughter. It's my beautiful little daughter. Oh, I can't stand to look at her. I've done all this stuff. Is there any point to this? Well, in some instances like these, parents decide to unplug the machine. Let nature take its course. Well, David, I made a decision, mate. Wait, are, are you saying that this is it for her? Well, if you're asking my medical opinion, I would say that she has very little chance to survive on her own. Well, I, I mean, I think that she deserves a chance to experience life not hooked up to all these machines and tubes. I think she's right. All right, well, I'll send in a nurse with some forms for you to sign. Yeah, let's take a walk. I'm going to leave. No, come on, just a minute. Come on. Go away. Yeah, me too. Hey, it's hard. I know it's hard. But sometimes you just got to put one foot in front of the other, even though you don't know where you're going. Here we go for the music. No, you're not. No, you're not. I've never seen you as together as you were today, David. All right, you're going to need to do this. Yeah, you're doing great. Darling, you need you, You've got to stay focused. Just when you think you don't have anything more to give, you got to find more to give. I don't know if I can. David, look, I know it's not politically correct to say this, but you have a man. Darlene needs you to be strong right now. I know, I know. Oh, hey, guys. Hey, let me show you how to steal candy on this machine over here. How do you do that? Well, you just need a hairpin on the solar and I'm... Hey, Darlene, you need to be strong. Hey, Darlene, you need to be strong. David, I know I'm not your dad, but you're like a son to me, and I'm going to get you through this. Stop it so fast, Joe. A year ago, things were simple, and then Darlene got pregnant, and we got married. I'm sorry, Mr. Palmer, but I'll admit that it took me a long time to even get used to the idea of being a father. <laughs> but now I am. And I want to do anything in the world. Just too much. I don't want to deal with that. Oh. Look, David, I ain't a philosopher. But everyone knows that if there's good, then there's bad, okay? Nobody thinks the bad stuff's ever going to happen to them. And then one day, wham, all of a sudden it does. And you think there's no way you can go on. But the day goes by. And another day goes by, then a week, a month, a year. You look back. Hey, I got through that. I don't know how I made it. I'm not going to let the couch. Can we walk? Yeah, sure. <laughs> If you're concerned about seeming clumsy or inexperienced, relax. You might have some people who like sex. And chances if your partner doesn't give a shit if you elbow him or her in the head or whatever. <laughs> Bullshit. She just looks so fragile. We'll let you listen. You're probably more or less if you fuck someone you're comfortable with. True. What am I gonna do? He now has a lot of sense of humor. True. Also, right I'm sure we should do this real quick. I know. And she comes from a long line of women who fight and survive. Sexy honey. Okay. Oh my, you were so beautiful. You know, when I was about five years old, we were riding in the car, and 
I'm what? running up against the that door. That picture makes me sick. And the door just popped open. And Ew. I to out of the car. And because I remember I looked down and I could see the road rushing underneath me. And I was literally like outside the car. And all of a sudden, out of nowhere, my mom reached over and she grabbed me from my hair and she pulled me back inside. What? What? And so, if you just if you let me explain like how all this goes. Well, I wasn't. It's just a bunch of reading. Here, I'm gonna read to you what it says. When a girl is born, her hemen is thick and contains a small opening, which allows for menstrual flow. When the time comes, your the membrane thins out over years as she reaches adolescence. Well, the opening enlarges. Some of the tissue is bored away or torn during 